Well, okay, okay. What shall we play today? Today we are continuing Power Wash Simulator. Last episode, we cleaned a van and we cleaned a filthy backyard. For new new levels, we have uh, cleaned the bungalow, cleaned the playground, and cleaned the dirt bike. I think we'll start off with something nice and quick today. Uh, so we'll do uh, clean the dirt bike just to get us warmed up to tackle a bigger job. So it's 75 bucks, clean the dirt bike. Joe Average, there's got to be something up with my dirt bike. You see, I'm one of life's winners. Every morning I put four slices of bread in the toaster, but only eat the slice that pops up first. When I have coffee, I only drink the bit that wins the race to my mouth. But on this bike, I always finish dead last. I'm wondering if there's mud stuck to the manifest or whatever it is slowing me down. I'm also kind of superstitious, so I haven't cleaned the thing in over 15 years. Thanks. Yeah, it might not be running too well if you haven't cleaned it in 15 years. Let's see, we got details. Yeah, it just shows us what's worth what. Um, yeah, we saw that in the last episode, so let's get started. Okay, here we are. We've got a pretty dirty dirt bike here. And yeah, we're just going to blast it away. I can't imagine this will take too long. It's pretty small. Look at that, see? Most of the grime's already off. We've already cleaned one thing. Get those dirty tires. Yeah, we'll hit it from the other side when we get over there. We're just going to keep moving around this way. I'll probably be able to clean almost all of this with greeny here. Yeah, I got some dirt hiding underneath here. What was that? Fairing? I don't even know what that is. There we go, tire. Nice. Just rolling in the money. Some dirt hiding down there. Looks like there's some dirt hiding in between these little cracks, too. What do we see? Yeah, there we go. And down here, fender clean. We're already at 94%. Some hiding on the tire down low. Where did we get the tire? Nope, hiding. There we go. Tire clean. What else are we missing? Fairing, exhaust. Exhaust is still dirty. Set on a weird angle. There we go. Up here, around the gas tank. Handlebars. Ugh. There we go. Frame. There's a lot of little pieces in this thing. Just crawl around and see what we can see. There we go. More fairing. Spoke set. Nice. Nice. Missing something somewhere. 99%. Still at least four things left. Nice. Brake discs. Sprocket. Swing arm. There we go. Brake discs. I see. Maybe from this side. There we go. There's one brake disc. Sprocket. There we go. Sprocket clean. Where is... Oh, yeah, this brake disc. I see it. There we go. Job complete. Clean as an egg. You're a legend. Nothing can stop me now. 
yeah, do what you got to do. Go get this thing dirty and send it back to me for more cleaning. Oh, yeah. I expected this to actually uh, take a little bit longer, but... Or, I mean, be a little shorter, but it is what it is. Okay, now that we're warmed up, let's say uh, the playground, that's probably really weird. I'm going to go for the house. Clean the bungalow. Hey, Doc. You know I mentioned my folks? Well, I think it's time their bungalow met your pressure washer. It's so filthy, it's hard to tell where the ground ends and the house begins. When I mentioned you to Ma, her eyes lit up. Pops moaned and said, The browner, the porch, the warmer, the torch. Which clearly means nothing, so he's overruled. If you can give the place a good cleanup, I'm sure it'd give them both a lift. Thanks again, Cal. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty dirty. When you look at, like, every other house on the street. Oh, there's an invisible wall. I can't go look at the other houses on the street. We're kind of confined to this area. Ugh. Let's uh, scout out the back. See how bad this is. Yeah, walls. Thankfully, nothing seems to be too high up. I will have to get on the roof. Um, there's some weird angles on this porch, but nothing too, too bad. Some gutters. Those are always fun. Nope. Oh, I'm so glad you're here. Calvin's such a good boy. He's a volcanologist, you know. Oh, is he now? Is there a volcano somewhere? There is a volcano somewhere. Looks like there's an inner edge to these, uh, what are these, driveway pieces? Does this all count as driveway? Oh, it does. I, it, the last level we did, these side things were uh, separate from the path. That doesn't seem to be the case here. Yeah, we might as well do the steps while we're here. There we go. Steps done. Oh, we got some yellow stuff on this. Uh, we know from the last level, the yellow stuff is fairly easy to remove with the uh, the yellow nozzle here. This is a pretty large surface, so I imagine we'll uh, once we get close to finish, we're gonna see a huge chunk just vanish, a chunk that we didn't touch. And we are finished the driveway. Beautiful. And as I said, we'll move on to the uh, garage next. Uh, are these walls separate? I'm not sure. I'm just going to do this. You know what? I'm going to clean this little bit here too, this side. Nice. Garage wall cleaned. Uh, let's get this garage door done now. Nice. Garage door cleaned. Take a step back, see what we've done. This house might look pretty nice when this is all finished. Okay, we side here, we just got a big flat side, so this should be nice and quick. Nice. We got the foundation cleaned on this side. Um, I'm hoping I can blast the top with one of my stronger nozzles, because I don't think I'm going to be able to do much damage to it with Greeny. Probably don't even need to be perfect. I'll just spray. See when it pings. There we go. Another wall done. 
Can't forget about these posts. Don't forget the posts. Seems to be a little bit more dirt hiding on it somewhere. Maybe it's around this side. There we go. Just gonna do this section of wall. Oh, there's a post clean, as I was saying. Just gonna do this section of wall here, then I'll move on to the next section. Nice. Yeah, so that did count as a separate section of wall. So I'm glad I tackled that first. Got those bricks. There was a little bit of dirt hiding down there. Okay, this looks like it's going to be fun. We got all these posts. We got some windows, frames, doors. Appears we have some moss or something here. Good thing we got this yellow one. It seems to be pretty good for this. Seem to be missing a little bit on this fence, though. Let's see if we can find it. Oh, that looks pretty dirty to me. This one's on the insides. There we go. There we go. Porch cleaned. Okay, this side's looking okay. Let's go around to the other side and see if... We oh, there it is. That'll do it. There we go. Cool. Starting to look pretty good back here. Calvin Miller. Ma keeps messaging me. They're getting really excited with how it's looking. Sounds like it's going great. It is, Cal. Thanks. There we go. Frame. Most of this on the window is coming off pretty easy. The edges are being a little more difficult. I'll just hit those with the red one. Max power. Cool. Window. Done. Door done. It's coming along. Should be good for the roof for now. Um, we're probably going to need to go on top before that actually pings, though. But other than that, we're almost done the backside walls already. We'll be in the front before we know it. Beautiful. We're almost done this side. Frame, check. Window, check. 
Gonna hit this spot, and then we'll move around to the... Well, not the last side. We still have half the front to do. We'll blast what we can reach from here. Okay, that's looking good. Yeah, it's much nicer without all the dirt. Got only one window on this wall, so that's not too bad. I'm kind of curious, how much is the next power washer? Because I bet you that will make a huge difference. Where do we got? Shop. Power washers. Medium duty. 900. Okay, we're almost there. We're only 90 off. 90 more dollars and we can get the Urban X U2. Compared to the light. A couple more bubs in surface, encrusted, embedded, tough, and it's way better with dealing with stubborn, stubborn grime, whatever stubborn classifies as. Nice, the bricks clean. I think we've almost got all the bricks done. Uh, if we go around the front and do that last little bit of bricks, that should be all the bricks. Is that doing anything? Um, let's grab my step ladder. I don't want to climb a whole ladder for this. Drop that there. Come on. No, I want to stand on the stool. There we go. Well, as you see here, we are almost done this wall. It should just be this little patch left and we'll move on to the front and then onto the roof. And there we go. That's another wall down. This side looks pretty complete. I don't think I missed anything over here, but you know, end game will tell. You always seem to miss something. Yeah, this doesn't look too bad. I mean, there's no porch on this side, so that should make it a bit, little bit easier. Calvin Miller. Okay, apparently even Pops is out of his rocking chair now and having a look. Cool. Senile guy is uh, taking an interest in how clean things are getting. Oh, this stupid ladder's in the way. I'm just going to pick this up and put it somewhere. Say garage. Here we go. Oh, God. No. Okay, come on. I want you to go here. Good. Door frame. Door should soon follow suit. That's a dirty door handle. Cool. Door is done. I'd hate to be the one that touches that every time going into this house, though. That handle was gross. There's the window. And there is the front wall. Let's take a step back and see how this is looking. Yeah, see, that's nice and clean. Once the roof's done, this will be perfect. We're currently sitting at 67%. We're $15 away from our $900 goal. I really hope that I can get this power washer so we, at least we could spray a little bit of this roof down with it before the next episode. Come on, get up. Come on, ladder, let me up. There we go. 
Maybe start with the gutters. Maybe the gutters will get us the 15 bucks we need. 10 dollars, yeah. The gutters will definitely get us the coinage we need to get that power washer. I'm gonna go hit up another gutter and that's the first thing we're gonna do. There we go. There's our another $10. We have $905. Power washers. Medium duty. Urban X U2. You are mine. Okay, so how do we change this? Oh, no. Nope. That's show me the dirt. Um, e. Okay, power washers. We don't want that one. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one's got some kick. Oh yeah, like nothing. Let's see if uh, green will now remove some moss. Comes right off. This is, this is good. This uh, roof is like the largest surface we have to tackle. So if we can do it with a wider nozzle, things will go way quicker. Nice, there's the last wall. At least I think that's the last wall. Where? Oh, maybe that's it. There we go. Chimney done. We're down to three. Two gutters, porch roof, bungalow roof. So we didn't miss anything on the ground level. Everything else we need to touch up is here on the roof. And we can wrap this job up. Here we are near the nearing the end of the porch roof. Perfect. Three things left. Two gutters and the rest of the roof. Oh, don't fall off the roof here. Oh no. Oh no. Ah, dang. Okay, let's go get our ladder. We're going to try to hit that gutter from another angle. Actually, while we're on this side, let's do this gutter, actually. Nice. One gutter left, rest of the roof. Grab our trusty ladder here. And we'll slap it right there. Nice, last gutter done. Job done. The bungalow looks amazing. Doc, thank you. You won't believe the impact it's had. Ma's down the woods picking flowers. Pop's muttering excitedly about another job he's got for you. So if you hear from a letter Miller, that's him. Cool, job done. Let's watch this time lapse. Yeah, you see, this is why I went around and did the backside first, because I knew that would happen. And there we go. Clean the bungalow. Complete. Well, that's about all we have time for today. If you liked this episode, please consider liking, commenting, and subscribing. In the next episode, we shall be tackling this playground for another $500. Take care, everyone.